いらっしゃいませ<笑> !Welcome back to ニャッピーカー !We're so glad that you can join us today! <笑> In today's video, we're going to talk about a kitty who was a mouser. And as you can see, he's got his cloth mice already caught just for the occasion. Yeah! <laughs> so we're going to talk about Ember today. Ember was a beautiful cat. Looking kitty who reminds me a whole lot of a kitty that lived to be very old in my family's household named Spunky. She was a cute little calico and she was adorable. She lived to be 23 years old and she was the smallest cat we've ever had with the biggest meow you've ever heard. I used to think that my kitty Sheba was loud. After all, Sheba was half Siamese, she was Tonkinese, and so she had an excuse. We expect it. But this cute little teeny calico, my heavens! <laughs> and I wouldn't be surprised if the same was true of Amber. So, She was at the distillery from right around 1987 until she passed away in 2004. She came there after Towser, very the most famous distillery cat I think there is on record. And he had been there for, I think, 24 years, as I recall. Yes, just amazing. And she was there for quite a few years, too, if you think about that. So the Glen Turret Distillery is the oldest functioning distillery in Scotland. And since they've opened up many, many years ago, they've always had a mouser, of whom Towser, as we know, was the famous one. But Amber came in right. After. And what is so hilarious is that I think Amber would have liked these cloth mice just like he does because she was known for not even catching one mouse. Yes, the chief mouser didn't even catch one. What's up with that? Yes, Towser, on the other hand, had numbers of mice. <laughs> But she was very friendly and camera happy. She enjoyed socializing with the public and she was just breathtaking. Such a cute little girl. Yeah. <laughs> she was there until 2004 when she finally had passed away. Well, she was a very, very precious part of that distillery, even if she didn't catch a bunch of mice. And, you know, he doesn't catch real mice, he catches cloth mice. But everything else is oh so wonderful that it more than makes up for any lack of mousing skills. Yes, and you're just so good at being cute, Nuffy. I think she had the same trait. I think so. <laughs> well, thank you all so much for watching this video today. If you like the contents of our videos, don't forget. To take those paws and paw that like button. You can paw the subscription button and you can paw the notification bell so that you can see all of Nuffy Cat's videos. Well, thank you all so very much. And we look forward to seeing you in the